Hey now, Mike Shaman here. In this tutorial video, I'm going to show you how to make an inline form with WP Fluent Forms. WP Fluent Forms is a great WordPress form builder for your WordPress websites. I've just gone to add a new form, and this is the blank slate that you have. I'm just going to add in the name fields right here, and I'm going to go and add in an email address right here. Okay? It doesn't matter where you add it in because we're going to change it in a minute. As you can see, they're not in line. If you go to the options, you're not going to be able to change the inline uh, with the name field there. So what you need to do is you just need to go to the container field right down here, okay? The container field, okay, container. And you wanna to go to three column container. All right, we need to add the name in first, or you, you know, you can add whatever you want in first. Okay, email address. And now the third one here, as you can see, you can't move the form button over there. So how do you get a form button right here in this position to get your fluent forms in line? But what you want to do is you want to go over here to the general fields again and you want to go to excuse me advanced fields and you want to go to custom submit button you want to drag that in there and then you can edit it to whatever your liking is so once you have the button there you can edit these other ones if you wanted to to get these uh name fields off that's what i would do just to keep it clean for an inline form and you just want to go to hide label and same thing you go to email and just go to hide label and go to save form. Now we can go to preview and design and there's our form right there. So that's how you make an inline form with WP Fluent Forms. I hope you guys enjoyed this tutorial. I have other Fluent Form tutorials on my website or on my YouTube channel there. So you can go check those out and I will see you all in the next video.